Okay, hey, what's going on, guys? Me here to have my video. Uh, yeah, so I usually do PvP videos, you know, all that type of stuff. But I've actually gotten into redstone. Uh, and I've decided to build a double piston extender, which at first, well, for my first one, took me a long time. So if you don't know what a double piston extender is, it extends the piston out twice. Well, it extends two pistons out so you can get this block to reach further. So, say if a wall's pretty far away, and the only way you can do it is with a double piston extender and you want to make it flush with the wall so you use a double piston extender see now it's flush with the wall now it's not uh... by the way guys this is not my first one ignore all these little redstone things that's not even redstone that was just knocking around this was my first double piston extender very bulky i think anybody in the world could make this a lot less bulky but here it is I actually do think it is a tiniest bit faster than this one. But yeah. So if you don't know what's happening, when you power this lever, it sends a signal through here, powering this one, which powers that piston. And yeah, you need that block there. I don't know why you need that block there, but you need that block there. If you want to go to any other YouTubers, I could explain it to you. I'm very new to Red Snow. Uh, and how it gets retracted. So when you pull this lever, it sends a signal through this observer down this redstone signal to a repeater on a 4 tick pulse it cannot be anything else besides a 4 tick or a 3 tick if you want your th thing to be fast then it goes down here into these two other repeaters now you want this one to go faster so it does this one first and this one to be 4 tick so it does this one second so you get that type of effect now you could just look at this pause the video here I'll give you Five seconds. Okay. Now that you've done that, you could probably just build it off there. But if you don't want to and you want to see me build it, because... Who knows? Maybe maybe you want to see me build it. Well, here you go. So what you want to do is you want to place one block up, place a piston there, a piston there, and you block one block of your choice there. Then what you want to do is you want to place the block of your choice there again and you don't need that anymore okay but you're still probably gonna want that in case you stuff anything up <laughs> okay so you want to place a lever on there you want to place a observer facing downwards and you want to place a repeater here you then want to place a block another block of your choice where the redstone and all that goes and then if you flick this on, you got the double piston extension, but when you turn it off, it, this happens. Okay. Oh, I've done a boo-boo. Here's how to fix it. For one, place, you, place your blocks back. So, what you want to do is you want to extend this out too. You want to bring this down. And then you want to extend this out to here. Put two blocks there, so it should look like that. You then want to place an observer facing that way, and then get redstone coming down from here. When you hit here, get a repeater with a four tick pulse. Get two redstone and two repeaters, and set this one, set this one to four ticks. When you turn it on, that puts an extension. When you turn it off, you get the uh, extension back. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, uh, let me know. I'll build more things. Uh, I'll learn and stuff. So yeah. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. This was a tutorial on how to build a double piston extender, as most people call it. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, like and subscribe and comment down below. Peace.